Hi people! In this video I'm going to show you a pretty huge skip I found in LBRS. And I'm not referring to the candlelight skip by Shadowhunter Washkelin, by the way. The skip I'm about to show you is done over at High Lord Omak. Now obviously I'm stealthing through because that's the easiest way for me to get to where I need to be. And I understand that most groups won't have this option. In order to do this skip, you will need some kind of slow fall effect, such as a mage's slow fall, the parachute cloak from engineering, or the effect from the noggin fogger elixir. You will also need some type of movement speed increase, such as a swiftness potion, dash, sprint, or anything like that. A hunter's aspect of the pack might even be enough. The bosses you do with a skip like this is High Lord Omak, Uruk Doomhull if you want to. Quartermaster Sigris, Halakon, Gisrul the Slavener, and Overlord Wormthalak. If you get lucky, you might see Gok Bashkud and any of the other ogre rares on the way to High Lord Omak. Now for the jump. First, make it up to this ledge here, which might take you a few jumps. Once there, make your way to the iron beam over here. Also watch out so you don't pull the mob up here, he can reach you from above. But if you just get away from him, he will reset. Once you've made it up onto the beam, apply your slow fall effect, and then use your speed effect. Then run and jump. Aim just to the left of this stone. Make sure to have the tank jump first, as you will aggro the bugs. And Voila! The skip is huge and it might allow you to spend 75% less time per LBRS run. This means that you can now farm things like these very easily. The gemstones from the last boss, the beastmaster's mantle, heart of the scale, the druid, tier zero shoulder, the hands of power, cloudrunner girdle and the annihilator receipt. There are of course a couple of more items but these were the ones I found more interesting. It's going to be great for me, now that I want to farm my druid tear zero shoulders. As you could see, I could stealth my way from the entrance to the last boss in 6 minutes. That's pretty crazy. Anyway, I hope you're curious to try this out. It's really going to make my life easier and I hope it helps you too. If you have any questions or just want to say hi, I stream over at twitch.tv slash clouds. This was all from me for now, I'll be back soon with another video. Until then, see ya!